In marketing, there's this thing called WOM strategy or word of mouth advertising, which is what any business should try to do. That means your clients actually love the product so much that they'll do your advertising for you. And usually in order to obtain that kind of free marketing, what you're going to have to do as a business is under promise over deliver. So in this video, we're going to check if SC Prime did just that, because looking at social media and YouTube, everybody's talking about SC Prime. It's your boy Marcel, aka Smokehelm. This video is sponsored by the like button. So scroll down a little bit, click that great thumb, make it turn blue for the YouTube algorithm. So this really sounds like a great project that can make you a lot of passive income, right? Well, I've been running SC Prime for right around a month, and in this video, we're gonna dive into how much I made. First of all, for y'all that don't know what SC Prime is, it is the distributed data center. They provide cloud storage, and how they do it is you actually run storage on your computer or their XA miner, and you get rewarded for it in their native token, SC Prime. As of right now, the network capacity is of around 42 petabytes and the usage is only around 650 terabytes so that means there's a lot of space not being utilized the reason why there's all this storage that's not being used or sold to clients is because they don't have enough clients yet and one thing they do to lure people in to get in on the project and actually become storage providers is they will provide incentives these incentives will obviously diminish over time as the project grows but as of right now, there are around 125 SC Prime per month per terabyte rented out. And the current price of SC Prime is $1.21. First things first, how do you actually provide storage for SC Prime? Well, you're either gonna need a computer on which you're gonna install hard drives or have existing hard drives with more than 500 gigs of space, or you can go the other route and buy, well, pre-order one of the XA miners. The fastest way to actually get into the project and provide storage is making your own. So having a computer lying around that you can use for this. And one big thing to note with going that route is that that computer is going to have to stay on 24 seven for the simple reason that when you provide storage, if someone wants to access their files at some time of the day and they cannot, that's gonna be a huge negative for them. So in order to avoid that, SC Prime has you put up some collateral, meaning you buy some tokens off of them that you lock up in exchange for providing storage. And you'll get those tokens back unless your computer turns off and someone tries to access their files. In that case, you will lose a part of your collateral, basically eating into your earnings, and we don't want that. So a little over a month ago now, I went on Amazon and I ordered 16 terabyte of hard drives. Why 16 terabytes? Well, we're gonna jump into their calculator right now and I'll show you why. So this is the calculator provided by XA Miner, which are technically affiliated with the SE Prime project. They basically sell storage providing solutions. So I went the other way and made my own, as we said. This is what 16 terabytes of storage will get you for a month. Let's say you rent out all of it at a price of 5 SC Prime per terabyte. You're going to get 1,920 SCP per month. And that's almost two grand for 450 bucks of hard drives and 200 bucks of collateral. Total investment was around $600. And this calculator says I can make two grand a month off of investing $600. Well, that sounds a bit too good to be true, and it is. The reason for that is, remember a bit earlier when I showed you the two graphs about how much total storage was provided on the network and how much was actually used? Well, there's not enough people using the storage right now for you to even fill up one terabyte in a month. Let's jump into my dashboard and I'll show you what I'm talking about. So here's my dashboard. As you can see, it's running online, up times 91%. Sometimes the computer does go down. There's not much I can do about that. You have the time ranges right here where it goes down. So we had issues in the beginning for a couple days trying to set up different DNS paths. And then the computer just will go offline from time to time for a couple minutes uh, or until I go check my dashboard and see that it's offline. Our total capacity is 16.2 terabytes and the total storage rented out is 116 gigs. So 
that's not even 1% of our total storage capacity. And so, so far in the month of February, in nine days of providing storage, we've made 1.74 SC prime. So a, a tiny bit under $3. I think by now you get it. It's a great project. The issue is they don't have enough clients. And so the storage that is being provided is not being necessarily utilized. One thing I would do differently if I knew this getting into the project is I wouldn't even buy hard drives. I just use my own computer to provide 500 gigs of storage instead of going out and buying and buying 32 times that amount of storage. Hopefully in the next couple months, the project can grow and they can acquire more clients. People will have more files to store and our storage will fill up, giving us more rewards. The thing is incentives are, as I said earlier, 125 SC prime per terabyte per month, but they're going down at a rate of 10 SC prime per month, meaning in a year we'll be at around five SC prime per terabyte per month. And that's probably when I'll hop off the bandwagon because I don't know if running a computer 24 seven will necessarily bring me a lot of revenue if I'm only getting around 80 bucks a month. If you have any questions about SC Prime, how to do the setup, if you want me to do a tutorial, please leave it in the comments. I actually had some help on my setup with a friend who's a developer. And uh, if y'all wanna see a tutorial, we might try to find a way to make that happen. 95% of you guys aren't subscribed, which not gonna lie, kinda sucks. The channel's gotten 40,000 views in the last 28 days. That's a lot, and we're at 2,300 subscribers. Thank you, by the way, for helping us pass 2,000. But guys, please just go down there, click subscribe, a lot more videos on crypto, passive income, finance, and lifestyle coming soon. Was your boy Marcel, aka Smokehelm, and I'll catch you guys later. Peace.